The Zeek Logs Analysis tool makes it easy to use Zeek across your PCAP files and view the log output in CloudShark. Zeek gives you another view of your data and simplifies summarizing, extracting, and investigating the traffic in a PCAP. To open the Zeek Logs tool, choose it from the Analysis Tools menu and view the capture. A dialog box presents all the available log files, presets, and saved views. Clicking on a log, a preset, or the Explore All Logs button will open the full page view of the Zeek Logs Analysis tool. The main window is broken into two sections, the sidebar and the log view. The sidebar shows any saved views that users have created and a list of all the log files generated by Zeek with their preset views curated by CloudShark. Clicking on any of the entries in the sidebar will load that view into the main part of the page. Here you can see the view's name, the log file it was generated from, a description of the view, and all the rows and columns of data. Clicking on any row within the table will bring up the row details pop-up. You can click previous and next in the pop-up to move around the table. When viewing the row details for a Zeek log that contains a UID value, CloudShark will present a view packets button to you in the footer of the dialog box. Clicking on this link will open a new tab of the capture file with a display filter applied based on the connection UID from Zeek. The table header contains a search box which will show only the rows in the table that match the string typed into the box. This is useful if you are looking for a value that may not appear exactly in a column, such as a partial IP address, a string, or other parts of fields. Pressing the return key updates the table, and clicking clear removes any search terms restoring all the rows in the table. Paging controls can be found in the table header, and sorting can be controlled by clicking the small arrows in each column header. The reset link in the top right returns your view to its starting. When you want to filter your table based on a specific value found in the table, use the column filter feature. There are two ways to activate this feature. One way is by hovering on a column header to make a push pin icon appear to access the column filters. Clicking on this icon will bring up a new dialog box containing all of the values found in the table and counts of how many rows they appear in. Clicking on a row in this view toggles a filter for that value on and off. A column filter can also be applied by clicking on a table row to bring up the row details view. This has a left-hand column of checkboxes that correspond to selected filters. Checking those boxes on and off will toggle column filters for those values. This is useful when you have found a row to investigate and want to filter on a value from that specific row. Clicking on the Customize Columns table header link will bring up the Column Picker dialog box. Here you have access to all the columns available in the chosen log and they can be turned on or off as you desire. You can select all or none, and CloudShark has two added shortcuts to help cut down on column overload. You can choose from the following presets. Multi-value chooses columns that have more than one value. If every row in the table for a given column is the same, including empty, it will be omitted. For example, in this log, the trans depth value for all rows is zero and is omitted. Non-empty enables any column that is not completely empty in all rows. For example, all rows in this log have an empty referrer call and the column is omitted. When you're customizing columns, add the special underscore count column to the table. Now your rows will be aggregated and counted across the selected columns, giving you a quick count of which fields appear together. For example, adding the count to this list of HTTP requests shows 910 requests made with these values. After you have spent your time filtering, searching, sorting, and picking the information you want to see, you can save it. Clicking on the Save button in the top right corner will bring up a dialog box allowing you to name the new view and leave a markdown enabled description to accompany it. These views are saved to a special URL that you can then share with coworkers and other analysts to pick up where you left off. By leveraging the capabilities of Zeek Logs and CloudShark, you can efficiently analyze and interpret your network traffic data, enabling better network security and troubleshooting. Start exploring today and uncover valuable insights within your PCAP files.